Nelson. And I'm Amanda Hosel. And welcome back to HTTV, we tell you what's up. So let's uh, jump into the calendar for this week. So all throughout this week, the 18th to the uh, 22nd was uh, FFA week. So it was a big uh, week for the uh, people in FFA. So uh, Monday the 18th, uh, girls basketball region started and the girls played Iroquois here and they uh, came out with a win. So then the 19th was Girls Basketball Regions Round 2, and we played Castlewood and lost. So the girls' season came to an end in that game. Um, 21st uh, was the big community FFA breakfast in the morning, and uh, Girls Basketball Regions continues at Madison. It's also Kayla Fashing's birthday today. So happy birthday to her. Um, the 22nd, we have school, and there's a boys' basketball game versus Northwestern at Tulare. And it's Mason Bottoms' birthday, so happy birthday, Mason. And the Northwestern game is also the boys' last regular season game of the uh, season. Uh, Saturday the 23rd, junior high girls basketball and boys basketball at Iroquois. And that about wraps it up for this week. So now let's uh, throw it over to Kobe for sports. Hello, my name is Kobe, and I'm here with the Hitchcock Tuler TV Sports News. On February 14th, the girls played Woolsey Westington and Woolsey, and they won 48 to 43. And Elizabeth Solomon was the leading scorer with 20 points and eight rebounds. The same day, the boys played Woolsey, and they lost 68 to 31. And Ty Hofer was the leading scorer with 14 points and four rebounds. On February 18th, the girls played Iroquois for the first round, and they won 57 to 17. And Elizabeth Solomon was the leading scorer with 20 points and had five rebounds. The next day, on February 19th, the girls went and played Castlewood in white, and they lost 63 to 32. And Elizabeth Solomon was the leading scorer with 12 points. Back to you. Thanks, Kobe, for uh, telling us what's been happening in sports. So uh, we got the chance to interview Grant Hamilton, the president of uh, the FFA and he told us a little bit about FFA week and what they did throughout the week and um, just uh, why it's important to do this week. Hi, I'm Peyton Nelson. I'm here with Grant Hamilton. So this week was FFA week, so uh, what did you do throughout the week? Uh, Monday was the corn count, Tuesday was 8th grade initiation, Wednesday was green hand day, and Thursday was the community breakfast. Why is this week so important for FFA? Um, it recognizes the FFA organization and shows uh, the community what we're all about. All right. Thank you, Grant. Thanks, Peyton, for that interview. So that about wraps up uh, this week's edition of HTTV. And remember to be awesome and not average. average.